नेक्स्ट स्पीकर श्री एम पी अब्दुल समद समदानी जी थैंक यू सर थैंक यू सर फॉर परमिटिंग मी टू टेक पार्ट इन दिस वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट डिस्कशन ऑन चांदियान सर मून हैज ऑलवेज कैप्चर्ड द इमेजिनेशन ऑफ ह्यूमैनिटी एंड सर द मून लैंडिंग इज क्वेट नेचुरल इट हैज कैप्चर्ड नॉट ओनली द इमेजिनेशन ऑफ द कंट्रीमैन ऑल द पीपल ऑफ द कंट्री not only that sir the all country is rejoicing about this great achievement of india becoming only the fourth nation in the moon landing after the us russia and china sir the poet of all the languages has <coughs> celebrated moon i am reminded of a couplet sir kal chaudhvin ki raat thi कल चौधवी की रात थी शब भर रहा चर्चा तेरा शब भर रहा चर्चा तेरा कुछ ने कहा यह चांद है कुछ ने कहा चेहरा तेरा और यह चेहरा सर देश का चेहरा है देश का चेहरा है इस पर हर भारतवासी को फख्र है गर्व है एंड ऑल्सो सर इट इज द अचीवमेंट ऑफ द इसरो the great scientists of the country when we say this is the achievement of the government of the country sir i have to reinstate the point that the government is a continuous entity government is a continuous entity sir that the present government also has to acknowledge sir when we think of the space missions of the country we have to think of the great two great luminaries stalwarts <laughs> whose names start with the n in english newton and nehru newton and nehru newton the luminary of science nehru the great luminary of wisdom science learning politics everything yes sir and sir there is a famous statement of sir isaac newton which has become almost like a metaphor standing on the shoulders of giants everybody knows the importance of the message of this statement everybody making some achievement in the field of science technology in any branch of learning wisdom sir they have to acknowledge the past the heritage of the past the stalwarts stalwarts who have made, who have made the present generation deserving for this great achievement and also sir i have we have to salute to other great luminaries one maulana abul kalam azad the philosopher minister of education the comrade of nehru ji who was the first as the minister of education when india attained independence he great great imputers for scientific temperament in inculcating in the minds of the younger generation of the country we know sir he was responsible for establishing all the academies which are the proud of the country now sahitya academy lalitakala academy sangeet nadaka academy all was all these great institutions were established by none other than maulana abul kalam azad and also sir vikram sara bhai who was the friend of nehru nehru vikram sara bhai mutuality it is not a mutuality of uh, pol politics and science alone it is the mutuality of uh, culture learning philosophy and sir much has been discussed here about the role of religion faith and science sir we have no <coughs> difference of opinion with the role of all these things have to play in the in shaping the destiny of humanity but sir one thing has to be admitted and acknowledged these are different roads to truth to reality there cannot be mixing of religion with the science and this this kind of an opportunity cannot be used to spread superstitions <coughs> sir scientific achievement cannot be used and utilized for spreading su superstitious beliefs sir there should be a mentality of rationality mentality of the rationality is the necessity of humanity whatever achievement the humanity has gained mentality in its history of rational yes sir everybody has yes sir has to be rational but that is what is missing nowadays sir 
so the, the honorable minister was referring so many times to the relationship of science with religion, science with the culture, no doubt. But sir, everything has an orbit of its own. Let us look to the sky. Sky is moving in its orbit. Moon, moon is moving its, in its orbit. Let the faith and religion move in its own orbit and science in its own orbit. There are different roads to reality they, they, which do not collide. There should not be made a co 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 coalition. Co coalition. There, be, there must be coalition and coordination. And sir, one other, another very important lesson that we have to, to, to learn from sky, from the universe, that is the lesson of plurality. Sir, in, 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 the, in, the, in the sky, all the stars, the planets, the, all the other uh, particles of the country. Sir, Newton's theory of gravitation, what is the essence of it? Yes. Every particle of, every particle is attracting another particle of the universe, attracting. Newton's theory is the theory of inclusion. Newton's theory is not yes. the theory of exclusion, which is somebody, which these present day uh, people and the present day people who, who spread hatred Some the country. Yes, sir, I am concluding, sir. And also, sir, this has to be hailed as an achievement of man. Though man is made of clay, he is made of that essence of moon and star. These particles are there inside man. And also, sir, in, in, in this kind of a very important juncture, we have to inculcate, we have to spread the culture of pluralism. Every part of the country, every region has made its own, its own role, played its own role in, in uh, making this achievement a reality. And uh, every pe uh, people of uh, different sections of the community and the society, they have also made, sir, their con contribution. Their contribution. Sir, I conclude by quoting another couplet. Bechain, bechain is kadartha ke soya narat bhar. Bechain is kadartha ke soya narat bhar. Palkon se likh raha tha tera naam chand par. Palkon se likh raha tha tera naam chand par. Hamare desh ka naam chand par likhne ka wo, wo process Nehru ji ne shiru kiya. Ab wo hum, hum hume fakhr hai. Hume garv hai. Wo jari rikhne mein. Thank you sir. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Now the supplementary business. Honorable Minister Sri